Well, welcome to a cold winter night. This is the latest tune that uh, that we had, and we've had a lot of cold winter nights this year. So, uh, I'd like to play it for you, and then we'll break it down and teach it to you. So, it goes like this. <laughs> Okay, now we're going to start out by playing this in the key of D, and as, of course my right hand bridge is tuned different than probably yours will be, but as long as you know where your notes are, it won't make any difference. My br middle bridge is still the same. So what I'm going to do is start on the A note, and so then we're going to go into the key of D, and it's, I call it the H pattern. One, three, five, and eight. So we're going to go with the A note. Now <clears throat> I'm going to go and I'm going to double up on that last note. Like this. So let's, let's do that again. Now then I'm going to move on to the next one. So. Do that again. Now, we're going to move on a little bit farther. We're going to change our key now, so we're going to go. Now, what we're going into here is an A7. We're going to use that Gina. And so we're going to go straight across. And if you use that same pattern, we're going to go down two notes lower. And then bring your right down two more notes. So. Okay, let's do this again. Now, when we do this, if, you instrument, if your instrument is in the D as your low scale, you'll want to go on your right side. We're going to use these notes. Now, if you have a low scale, A scale, then you're going to... <clears throat> now, this run is going to be... We're going to move it up, and then the next notes are going to be half, so. 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 Sorry for the clock interference there. <laughs> but anyway, all right, let's go back to the beginning, and... to run. So. That comes back to your D chord. So let's do that again. I go and call that a backwards H. And I go further down to my low a, a D chord, which uh, ends your A. 
So let's let's go again. again. Now, if you notice, I syncopate some of those beats, and uh, but what amounts to is if you drop your rhythm on on one note, you like if you go out then you have to drop it again in order to come back in. So. on your ending. Now I'm going to stop after the first time and then I'm going to stop again after the second. So to the B part and the B part of course we're going to walk up from D to G and then what it does it has a quick C that comes into it so so that's my G here's a C and that's C and it goes right back to G Put in, we can put in a, and 
basically the same thing, only this is in the key of A. Now, let's go again. Now we're going to come right back to the last line of the A part. through. 